determine how can you determine if an employee's motivated or not motivated? You can do the official reviews every three months or six months, how, whatever your schedule is there. Um, you could um, uh, measure performance. I think perhaps the best way is the informal communication, the chit chat that goes on, and um, the sort of the informal one on one. A lot goes on that's not in a formal structure. In fact, most of what goes on in your company is not, is not within the formal structure. Uh, it's not on a job review. Most of what goes on is, is, the, is the talking back and forth. Um, <clears throat> let me give you an example of um, uh, and, and what else. Uh, they will tell you very often. People will. But you want to be careful. If you don't really know them very well, maybe they're reluctant to sort of let it out. Because remember, uh, a lot of folks see it's us versus them. Employees see we the employees versus management ownership. Um, um, it's us versus them. But the biggest way is to use your personal skills and get to know them. And it's not rocket science. Most people aren't that complex. You can find out the primary big motivators there. Um, let me give you uh, an example of, of one potential uh, motivator would be uh, you could find out by giving an open-ended assignment kind of like what we did with the calling the 10 uh, customers that uh, have back orders that's an open-ended assignment you're not saying exactly how to do that you could say uh, make it a closed assignment and say well I want you to call each one of these and just you know give them a special offer that's a closed assignment open assignments are more challenging in that they allow the employee they give the employee some flexibility on their own to complete the job. Closed assignments is you're telling them how you want it done and they better do it or else. Uh, that's another way. So um, one-on-one, -on -one, um, informal conversations, the job reviews, uh, the company meetings you can see in there too. So you use all that input and then um, um, you still can't read some people, they'll still be difficult, but most people, you should be able to, I'd say 80% of your people, you ought to be able to pretty well determine where they're coming from.